Greetings, Internet. My name is Insane Ian, and welcome to another episode of Insane Ian Makes His Teeth Fall Out by Eating Snacky Things. Whatever. This week, we have some brand new candy bars. Or candy snack things. First, we have Reese's Peanut Butter Cups filled with crunchy cookies. Ooh. And, brand new, in stores now, and have been for at least a few weeks, Hershey's Gold. I love gold. You know, because Austin Powers had that character. Topical. Anyway, it's caramelized cream with peanuts and pretzels. So it's not a chocolate bar. It's basically caramel cream bar, sweet meets salty, creamy meets crunchy. That's what it says right there on the wrapper. If the camera would focus on it. You know what I'm saying. So this is Hershey's new thing. We'll try this second. First, we're going with the Reese's. Now, Reese's has recently, it's kind of hard to say. Reese's has recently been releasing it's just getting tougher. Reese's has recently been releasing some candy with other candy in it. They've released Reese's, oh man. They've released Reese's peanut butter cups with Reese's pieces inside. This is the weirdest tongue twister I've ever had to say. Now, instead of Reese's pieces inside the Reese's cups, we have crunchy cookie. I'm excited because I like Reese's peanut butter cups. And I like crunchy cookies. So here we are, together at last. So I'm going to try this, and you're going to watch, because that's kind of what this show is all about. Just Reese's stuffed with crunchy cookie. That's all it says on the tin. Looks like a normal Reese's peanut butter cup. Smells like a normal Reese's peanut butter cup. There is no wrong way to eat a Reese's, so I'm told. Now a little bit of chocolate came off, and it appears that there is cookie inside there. Ooh, Trixie. Here we go. Hmm. Doesn't get any more descriptive than that. It's a Reese's cup, and there's cookie bits inside. And they're crunchy. And that's it! Little crunchy cookie bits inside a Reese's cup. Delicious. There's no mystery to how that's going to taste. If you like the Reese's Cups, it's a Reese's Cup. But it's got crunch in it now because there's bits of cookie in it. It literally tells you what to expect. I mean, I'll be honest, most of these tell you what to expect, but you don't know until you try it. This one, it doesn't get any simpler. And that's fine. I'm a simple man, clearly. So I don't need that many surprises. That said, let's go for the gold. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for saying that. I know it was corny. W whatever, I've done a couple of these back to back and it affects my talking hole. The caramelized cream, that's that's what's concerning me. The back of the label shows you what color to expect, but it's not set up in the same four pieces across several times the way that most Hershey bars are. Or not four pieces across, but three pieces across, or however many they usually do it. I don't know how they break it up, but it looks like a Tetris piece right now. Fine, just something I was noticing and wanted to show you. Now, admittedly, I've had these for a couple weeks in my fridge. They're not cold anymore. I took them out and shot a couple videos before this, but they have been there for a little bit. So let's break off a piece of this. Interesting caramel color. Smelling the peanut immediately. Little hint of the breaded pretzel type object smell. You can definitely see that on the other side. Not getting an immediate caramel scent. There's definitely one there, it's just not as strong. So we're gonna take this small piece, this this little brick of three here, break off a piece of that and try it. Hershey's. You ever notice they they spell out Hershey's in the chocolate? That deprives you of chocolate. You guys owe me some letters. That's a bitch Hedberg joke. Rest in peace, Mitch. And obviously this is not chocolate, this is caramelized cream. So it's a little different, but I was quoting a comedian. It's fine. Mm. 
That's interesting. It's definitely creamy caramel, and yet you're hit with the salty, savory taste of the peanuts and the pretzel. So it's sweet and salty. At the same time, it's really good. It's not a chocolate bar, it's caramel cream. It melts like chocolate in your fingers, and it's melting in my hand right now. But it's definitely not chocolate, it's just kind of chocolate-like. But it doesn't taste like chocolate. It just seems like a chocolate bar because we're familiar with the shape. But it definitely doesn't taste like one. It's definitely a creamy caramel. That sweetness flavor is immediately thrown off by the salty, savory flavor of the peanuts and the pretzel. It's bizarre, and yet really good. It's like they cracked some sort of secret code. I think it works so well because it's not chocolate. Just putting peanuts and, and pretzels in a chocolate bar, we've had that, we know what that is. Making it caramelized cream, or, or, or creamy caramel, whatever you want to call it, a caramel flavor, a sweet flavor, that we're not used to having in a bar form, and then including the salty, savory peanuts and pretzels, it's really good. It's really unique. I don't think I've had anything like that. At least, not that I can think of off the top of my head right now. It's crazy, but it's really good. Well, that's all for this week. I hope you enjoy these videos. If you do, maybe consider liking, sharing, and if you haven't already, subscribing to my channel. You can also check out my Patreon, where you can see these videos early, plus check out making of videos, music videos, song commentary, and a whole lot more exclusively over on my Patreon channel. Plus, you can check out all the videos in this series in these two playlists. Thanks a lot, folks. Hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye! Oh, I shouldn't do these videos back to back. I got me a tummy ache. Oh, so much candy.